lyricist, so you yeah. know a lot, of, a lot of people don't appreciate them, but I feel like you appreciate them. So when you talk about hip hop, is that who you talking about? Yes, I am. And you know what? The, the, you got to remember, your superstars in rap tend to come out of the lyricists. So Biggie was a lyricist. He just learned how to sell a lot of records. LL Cool J was a battle rapper. He was a lyricist. Niggas be forgetting, you know, some niggas. Now, some of the niggas that come out that win are trash rap. But a lot of the ones with the sustaining power are lyricists. Jay-Z can rhyme. Uh, Eminem is a lyricist. All them niggas that your top echelon, that you know, the new the new people that you you know, you, or they argue about who's who's uh, successful. So even even you know your Kendricks and your and your J Cole's niggas is really backpack rap. That's technically at the end of the day you or whatever you you got to call it lyricism. The J D Kiss niggas got bars. Do you see yourself as a backpack rapper though? <laughs> Depends on how you call it. So I had a backpack when I was a kid. My friends will tell you this. I kept a 40 ounce in my backpack and I kept a burner, but I had a rhyme book in there too. So I don't care. I don't, I don't think it's nothing wrong. I had a jazz sport. I remember my jazz sport. Jansport. Them niggas I had dope on their jazz sport. It's still backpack. I don't care. You know what I'm saying? So yeah. I'm not I'm not against the term backpack, but I'm not, I'm probably wasn't nerdy. Yeah, come on, dude. I'm not that guy. You know what I'm saying? I'm not that dude. 